The United Evangelic Mission Delegation visited Urumuri, a group of residents of Remera Rukoma sector of Kamonyi district that includes both genocide survivors and perpetrators. During their testimony, the residents say they have geared their efforts towards unity and reconciliation and overcome a tragic past. I played a role in the genocide, but today I live in harmony with genocide survivors. We visit and share with one another. I'm a genocide survivor with a husband. I have a cow and share its milk with a person who was released from prison. We share our harvest. When I have a wedding, I invite them. We work together in our daily lives and it's a great stride we have made. The visiting delegation said Rwanda's journey of unity and reconciliation should serve as example for other countries across the globe. This is an experience which uh, I, I think... Uh, many countries or many people from Africa, especially Africa, would come and visit and see uh, how human beings can, uh, can turn to kill each other. Not only to my country, but to the United Evangelical Mission that we have here an example of reconciliation other countries and other churches can learn, learn from. So there are still some of our members who have experienced genocides, not only ethnic genocides, but also political genocides, and they have not worked on that. So this is what I take, that we should immediately start after something happens to investigate what were the reasons and how we can reconcile with one another. This was reiterated by faith-based organizations that say people ought to play a greater role in unity and reconciliation of citizens. It is very crucial for religious people to apply the word of God in their daily lives. In our parishes, we work hard as Christians to play a role in unity, forgiveness and development. Before visiting the Remera Rukuma residents, members of the United Evangelic Mission visited the Kigali Genocide Memorial Center at Gisozi.